So I've got a kangaroo, and this is quite uh, difficult to fish out. I've used my hands. This is a bag of poo. Why did you put it in a bag? <laughs> because, because, you... <laughs> because it rhymes better in a bag. Uh, it got what, does a that, what does that mean? What does it sound like? and welcome to Sounds Like, the only panel show that's all about rhymes. I'm the host of this Sounds Like. How? Why? Because it's my fucking show. Stop asking questions, you bum. Joining me as always in Rhyme Square, he's a rhyming sensation. Look upon his lines in amazement. His little face is a minor frustration. It's Jaime me blazement. <laughs> hey, bud. Sharon can't actually make it. I thought he wouldn't have missed this. Since we're having to change, it's looking a bit shit. It's bad than a nameless bullets and kid twist. Hey! hey. Do, you, do you have any um, challenges to, to kick us off with, pleasey boy? Let's get a quick rhyme going, man. I've got three on the same scheme, okay? So the scheme is the- four finger. I said it's four finger. Yeah. Four finger. clue is a spice for food. Raw ginger. Yeah. Yeah, right. The speed. You are all lucky I'm not a contestant. So if I, yeah, so we got Raw Ginger. If I said there's a, a J. Cole album. Um, uh, Born Sinner. Yeah, Born Sinner, nice. nice I'm nice, nice. very proud to admit I don't know the singer. Yeah. The J. Cole. <laughs> okay. Not my area of expertise. <laughs> right sure. uh, last one for you. Uh, is the mother in the Adams family. Morticia. Morticia. Morticia, there we go. Lovely jubby, good stuff. I wrote down Morticia. But it was written just below the words daily wank habits. And I honestly can't remember why I wrote that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that note was for. It says wet dream challenge and daily wank habits. Aussie accent. We've got some uh, some amazing guests with us today and others. So let's do the introductions now. It's the guy with the big dick can write rhymes on instinct. <laughs> Simply put, he is the business. This Canada's own oh. kid twist. I mean, honestly, that was probably one of the most complimentary introductions I've heard from this show. So thank you. Forget the big. Just to say that you've got a penis is a compliment in a way. Yeah, I, I mean, it's that's definitely a step above what you're usually saying to introduce <laughs> guests. So yeah, absolutely. I go where the rhymes take me. I don't go. I don't intend to offend. I just go where the rhymes lead. Um, next up is a sadist. With him on it, it'll be a great mix. We don't know what his name is, so we'll just call him Nameless. Mm. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm excited to be on the show. I absolutely love what you guys are doing with this. Everything about it except for Shuffle Tea is incredible, and I'm really excited to see it. As a Thank you, man. Pro. Thank you. And this guy is fucking crooked. He's been stealing rhymes from Shuffle's booklet. Well, you, well, would you bloody look it? It's the one and only hundred bullets. A hundred of them. And next up, he's a rascal. I've changed my accent so it doesn't seem as natural. Oh no, wait. <laughs> right, okay, let's start again. He's a rascal. Nice. I've changed my accent so it doesn't seem as natural. Bites hold of a rhyme and never gets. Let's go like he's a jackal. Right. It's the fuck up of all fuck ups. Liam Bagnall. Hi. Hi. Round one. Now this is Rhymes in the Wild. This is where each contestant is charged with finding two items that make the best rhymes they can in real life from around their houses. Please, can you give us an example for the people at home? It was my birthday, so I had some drinks yesterday. And it definitely wasn't pink lemonade. Some drinks yesterday, pink lemonade, oh. very good, yeah. But I didn't, I didn't get a big heavy cake. All that's left is this empty tray. Hey! hey now yeah. run off and make a quick getaway. <laughs> Investigate. <laughs> all right, let's stop this now. First of all, let's go with Nameless. All right, what's your rhyme in the world? Come on, boy. Okay. Um, so this is a weird one because I don't know if you know this, but in Canada, when uh, when you score your first ha- hat trick in hockey, they give you the pucks 
that you scored with. And so our family's kind of passed them down. And I have here um, my mom and auntie's hockey pucks. Mom and auntie's hockey pucks. Okay. And then I'm a, I'm a bit of a collector. So I have a couple, um, couple things in my collection here. This is Mahatma Gandhi's coffee mug. I <laughs> How do you have that? <laughs> Prove it. Also, oh, shit. This is Muhammad Ali's boxing glove. All three of them. Uh, <laughs> I'll Joel. only accept two, please, if I see any more. That's yeah, it. He's, he's already oh, broken the rules, but yeah. You know I mean? yeah, yeah. Never mind the rules. Have you thought of selling those? <laughs> <laughs> like you make a mint. <laughs> I will see how the value continues to go up, but um, these two hockey pucks, I'm definitely keeping. Those are yeah. my mom and auntie, which is exactly <laughs> the language. So I don't hear any of this forced business. <laughs> All right, next up, 100 Belay. All right, so. Is your rhyme in the wild, pretty please, young man. So I got um something to weight lift. So off. Jeez. At the end here, you've seen some like dust from the pavement. <laughs> in my, in my unfinished basement. Oh, hey! Fuck. Hey. Oh, that's what I got. Very nice. And well, the I dust what... is definitely from the pavement, is it? Yeah, it's actually pavement down there. Just okay. Smart ass, you know. What I'm saying it's unfinished. Yeah. Mm. So the dust is there. You know what I mean? It's from the pa- okay. I see. Isn't isn't the pavement outside on the street? It's also here because the floor right. is also unfinished. Because that are you calling him a liar? Trip. No, no, I yeah, wouldn't. He's, like, he's on my team. He't He's on my team. I don't yeah. know why I asked. I've never seen a pavement inside. I will. I will tell you that. Oh no, no, yeah, it, it, it does happen. Would I mean, the, I'm from maybe. the streets. Yeah. You, the streets is even inside. <laughs> so you take the streets with you. You take the streets with you. Man. There you the go. streets follow me wherever I go, except for battle rap, where I try and keep you guys safe. From <laughs> don't make them use one of those hundred bullets on you, Bagnell. You don't want to. I will not. I got a, a multitude of them. He's got an extra artillery ready to go. All right, next up. We have um, Nameless. It's good to have you on, finally. Oh, no. No, we've, we've done that's that. That's a twist. No, sorry, yeah. This, <laughs> they're next to each other, so it's... It doesn't work as well when he grew his beard out and mine is trimmed up to here now. <laughs> did you mean that as well, Kid Twist? A little multi just dropped there. <laughs> not oh, at all. What did go. I say? <laughs> beard grow down. You know, you said, you, you said you, uh, he uh, grew his beard out and mine's up to here now. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh. Damn. All right. Okay. I'm clearly warmed up. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go here, <laughs> I even know it. Uh, Twist. Uh, h- how are you doing? How's life? Uh, sort of uh, post-bodied. Uh, like, ha- ha- you know, what's what? What are you doing? What's 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 new? What's different? Yeah, man. Uh, it's it's been great. I've just been um, kind of uh, getting some continued screenwriting opportunities, which is amazing. So I'm sort of in in the field well kind of in the field that i always wanted to be i thought it would be more books but you know i'm not going to complain about about film and tv um so yeah uh the the most recent thing that was released that i worked on and it's crazy like the lag time too because i wrote this in 2018 and it came out a couple months ago um but Mm -hmm. the anime yasuke on netflix which is pretty cool crazy um what's it called it's called yasuke um y-a-s-u-k-e uh, Flying Lotus did the score for it and was also oh. involved uh, creatively as an executive producer. So that was pretty fucking nuts to get a chance to work with him a little bit. That's amazing. Um, and then the other thing that I worked on that's been announced um, that is currently in production is called Captain Laserhawk, which is uh, an absolutely insane show based on some Ubisoft video game properties. So uh, oh pretty, pretty excited for people to finally get to see that because... Um, in terms of the scripts, it's just absolutely nuts. So <laughs> I can't wait to see. It's a French animation studio doing it. So I'm very excited right. to see how the French interpret uh, the insane <laughs> nonsense we wrote. <laughs> That's so cool, man. That's so cool. That sounds really, really quite cool. Um, yeah, man, it's been, it's been a good run. So just trying to keep it going. Speaking of cool, did you find two things from around your house that rhyme together? <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> Great segue. Great segues <laughs> on this show, always. Um, so I don't know how or why I have this, but I have this uh, model pagoda, mm. as you can see. It is a model pagoda. Uh, model pagoda. Uh, and then also from my soda stream just made this morning, I have a bottle of soda. <laughs> Very good. Uh, Very as, good. As an added bonus, as you can see, I'm sitting on a modular sofa. Sofa. So, yeah. 
What's modular? Yeah, uh, it can. This, there's a piece over here that could be over here if my apartment layout was different. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's shuffle, what I, know, that's that. I bet you'd be much better at hosting shuffle if you knew words. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Just for argument's sake, I mean, uh, you know, obviously our team, everything's above the board always. But let's just say for argument's sake, that boxing glove did not belong to Muhammad Ali and the coffee cup did not belong to Mahatma Gandhi. Okay, I'll try to imagine that. And I'm actually actually on the pavement, though. Y'all are tripping this. (laughs) (laughs) What do you make the pavement? What's the pavement made with? It's made with cement, right? What's the pavement made with? It's it's made of cement, yeah, but you wouldn't call it... You know, and it's the not cement. pavement inside, that's just the floor. Man. Oh, because the, 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 the difference is, it's like when you call stairs and steps. Stairs are inside, but steps yeah. are outside. It's like that. You can't call it pavement. Oh, where did that come from? Whoa. I've never, that's crazy. I've never heard that logic. Yeah, that seems, that seems British to me. I don't know. No, no, that's not even British. <laughs> that that's British shit to me. I don't know. That's yes. made up. <laughs> Dude, there's a difference, man. That's made up. I've never heard that anyway. Oh, but Liam. Um, yeah. Episode 19. Yes. Series two, episode nine. Yeah, big boy bollocks right now. Yeah, massive. Uh, we've we've nearly finished two entire series. I'm leaning back to try and unblur myself, and then yeah. confidently moving forward. I feel like if I, <laughs> I sort of feel like I need to be like stern with the camera, and it responds to that. Yeah, but it doesn't. <laughs> Hang on. If I go back here, you got to wipe the screen or something. You're yeah. you're messy. Are Look, you saying that my ejaculate that I put on it isn't helping? Right. You're- your there you go. Look, I was going to say, yeah, we've, 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 got two, we've got two bands in here. We've got Red Hot Chili Peppers and Blur. Hey! There we go. There we go. And it's the sort of, do you know what I mean? And, and he's hung over. And he's hung over. And he's still yeah, imagine oh, just kidding it. Oh. Just, just for free. Yeah, we're... we're, we're yeah. 19 episode episodes 19, in. Series two, episode nine. It's big boy bollocks right now. Yes. We've nearly finished two entire series. Yes. How are you feeling about the future sounds like? What new and exciting directions can you see it heading in? And what changes are you going to make to see them come to fruition? Um, I was, I was thinking of maybe getting a new host in. Um, <laughs> you're going to say hat. <laughs> no, no. I might, I, might, I might get a new hat. I might change my hairdo. The, the main thing I'd like to do is for us to take it live um, and do it outside somewhere. Maybe in the street. I don't know. On the pavement. Well, on, on, the, the pavement. on the pavement. Well, we I know some pavement around bullets, someone's house yeah. that would be great for us to do it on. Make sure we, we do it down the steps. Yes. On the, of the pavement. <laughs> That's right. That's exactly yeah. right. But yeah, no, I'm excited. We got we got quite a big ending to the series, don't we, Adam? We do indeed. Oh, don't we, Bagnall? Oh, we do. We do. That that sounded like we're going to fuck on camera or something. The way I said that. Just, <laughs> That's just the big like. ending of series two. A <laughs> just, live love like. making session. All right, let's go. What's your rhyme in the wild? Um, yeah, I don't know if I've gone too far this time. Um, but, <laughs> this time? Uh, well, there, there's been <laughs> exactly. some interesting... So, so I've, I've just got this kangaroo, um, and I had to fish this out, so please... Why have you, why have you got that? Well, my girlfriend's Australian. She's got loads of... That was a bookend, wasn't it? I don't have a British bulldog well, yeah, well, model look, it's, it's, in it's, my... It's thing. a kangaroo. It holds my books. <laughs> It holds my books up, if anything. They haven't got a maple tree in their back garden, all these three. And I, had to, I had to fish this one out. So I've got a kangaroo, and this was quite uh, difficult to fish out. I would use my hands. This is a bag of poo. Um, and I got this from my cat, <laughs> That's from my cat litter tray. Uh, and... You bought on shit. I mean, you, you, you always figuratively bring on shit, but this time you actually yeah. solidified it into... You did shit last week. No, I you didn't. You did shit last I week in the fucking... I didn't you did do cat litter before. tray. I got mad. You shit did cat today. litter tray. It was full of shit. Oh, uh, look. I was uh, going to say, yeah, there was, wasn't there cat shit on another yeah, house? Yeah, uh, the second time <laughs> okay. you bought some cat shit or or on no, my I fucking uh, show. I, I literally didn't have much to. Why I, did you put it in a bag? <laughs> because, <laughs> because it rhymed better in a bag. Uh, it got, what, does that, what does that mean? What the fuck do you mean it rhymed better in a bag? Okay, here's my question. The shit didn't make any sound. When, when having a cat myself, when one empties the cat litter, you generally want to put the shit in like a garbage bag that can then yeah, go yeah, yeah. This appears to be like a Ziploc bag. <laughs> Definitely you, a sandwich you, bag. You're a fucking it's so psychopath. Okay. What are you <laughs> no, up no. to? Why are you collecting <laughs> cat shit? And then you I always got, have some to hand now. Why I is got, that thing that's... 
Look, there's black. Well, I haven't cleaned it. I don't think so. I was cleaning out the tray, and as I was cleaning out the tray, I noticed, oh, this would rhyme with a kangaroo. Um, oh my God. I don't think the idea of you getting inspiration mid cat shit excavation Look. is fucking. It, I hate Look, it. I, I walk really around the sick. house, and that's what happens to me. This is all I've got to do. I can just picture him like on his hands and knees next to the kitty litter box, whistling the sounds like theme song. <laughs> like, I can imagine your girlfriend on the phone to her mum being like, "Yeah, he's been sat, he's been down there for half an hour. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah. He just keeps mouthing the words <laughs> over and over again." He's the heart of a woman I butchered yeah. last week. Isn't that yeah. good? It's in a bag. Bagno, you need help. Yeah, maybe. Oh, hey, maybe. Bagno, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Agony. Look, right. You know what's funny is my my. <laughs> I write little notes to myself for the script, and it literally says they found some shit from around their homes. I didn't think that was serious. That's what they, I took that as direction. I was like, you know, I thought that's exactly what you wanted to do. Find some shit. All right. Yeah. Brilliant. Now they found some shit to show from in their homes. Literal. Who's gonna be the winner though? Please, it's, don't put it on the fucking camera again. I don't want to see your cat's shit. I think, I think in the fourth place we're going to put Liam Catnell. You know oh, I mean? that's that's <laughs> a, that is a robbery. That is mental. Liam Catnell, man. That's that is that mental. One, <laughs> Pavement. <laughs> He's on your team. I don't care. I respect where respect's due. Come on. Yo, if, if, if the biggest stretch <laughs> wins this, I'm gonna be here. super salty. <laughs> if all these boxing gloves and mum and dads, if that wins, I already know y'all are racist. She was exactly. mum and auntie as well. <laughs> To be fair, all three of you have come with... You, you've broken the rules already, because all three of you came with... We're not talking about Bagnall, fuck that. You guys... Yeah, yeah. Ooh, why not? Came with the... You all had three, man. It's only two items, isn't it? Um, you got to give them... I, I guess you got to just take the, the best two of the three. Them. Third place to Bullets. Ooh. I'm going to go... Race win enough. It's, win no, enough. this is really tough, man. I'm going to put... I'm going to win here. I win enough. I'm going to put Kid <laughs> Twist in second, and I'm going to pop Nameless in first. That money, boy. Yo, the biggest um, reach one. Ahead, don't judge crazy. Judge hard, but Mom and aunt, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not happy with mum and auntie. I'm not happy with that. It's crazy. Mum and auntie. <laughs> but... I never mentioned mum and auntie once, but he brought up pavement nine times. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> you know what's going on? Mum and auntie. Mom, I know what's going on. Ali, Muhammad Ali. Bullets. Bullets isn't actually in a basement. He's in front of a green screen. He just <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't lie. I set it Bullets up for the goes, rhyme and it's fucks, backfired. Fuck this. <laughs> Tears down the backdrop and walks off the set. <laughs> <laughs> it was all just a rhyme. Now, as we go through this week's episode, we're going to be monitoring Twitter as well uh, because we have a challenge for everyone watching to work on as we go through this episode. So it's quite a simple one this week because I thought that might increase engagement, uh, Bagnall. It's clever. Oh, Whoever right. can come up with the best rhyme for Squid Game will be our multilinguist of the week. So get on Twitter and use the hashtag sounds like show and we'll be retweeting and we'll announce the winner at the end of the episode. You are not allowed clickbait. Piff James. Definitely. Good old Good jump off rapper if we're talking about jump off rappers. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. Round two, the quick fire rhyme game, huh? This is where I will give a team words or a word and then a clue as to what rhymes with that word. You can't come up with just any old rhyme. You have to get it from the one in the clue. So if the rhyme scheme was Mr. Nobody and the clue was what are nameless and kid twist, the answer would be, of course, shitter clones of me, even if they were active eight years before I was wow. born. So we're going to start with Bagnell and Bullets. Uh, do you guys have a team name? I did say Bag Full of Bullets, and that was off the cuff, and a lot of people have been tweeting and saying that was fantastic. But um, what do you guys uh, want to go through? What, what, do, what do you think? Ten Pellets? <laughs> Pavement Squad? Pavement Squad. <laughs> Cash Me Outside, Pavement Squad. I'm sure you need more than two people to be a squad. No, well, no. I'm going to count you in. You've got three minutes. Three, two, one. Now, Puss in Boots. Guns don't kill people. 
Well, let's uh, do it. Well, let's yeah, do. they do. All right. Um, Matt Zippo, Marvel film. The, the most recent skip. one. Come on. Oh. Everyone still... No. Skip. No, skip. Fuck that. All right. Marvel. Hard to tell. The children. The bad guy from Smurfs. Gargamel. Gargamel. Uh, yeah, I'll give you that. It's Gar- Gargamel. Yeah, I'll oh. give you that. All right. Uh, Steven Seagal. Hitting the testes. Kicking the balls. <laughs> Steven Seagal. Oh. Uh, needing the balls. Yeah. Needing the balls. All right. Uh, Peter Morris. Bullet's most recent battle rap that was released was against who? Wait, I didn't even hear the rhyme. I forget who I Peter Morris. Peter Morris. Peter Morris. Peter Morris. He's the source. Did you? Was that your? No, your most recent. If he doesn't know, skip it. Skip it. All right. That was last lifetime. When I heard it, I jumped for joy. Heard it, I jumped for joy. Recent rap album. Heard it, I jumped for joy. It's like that, sorry. Heard it, I jumped for joy. When I heard it, I jumped for joy. Recent rap albums. Biggest news of the... They're, skip, they're skipping it. They're skipping. Okay. Skip. All right. Ticks and crosses. Bagno is such a... He's cheeky, is it? He's such... Oh, don't be such a... Billy Sausage. Yes. All right. Uh, tear gas. How'd you get that one? But not... you, you have a build-up of... Earwax. Yeah, you can't hear, man. All right, uh, amateur magician, a cellist. Um, um, who plays who plays old music from classical musician? Yes. Yeah. Okay, and that's time. Two minutes in, six points. All right. Can I, yeah. I can I introduce a new rule here where I get to steal the points for no. Black Widow? No. And- Lover boy. Oh, that's what that album was called. Oh, yeah. Nameless clocked him. It was yeah, uh, Matt Zippo. It was Black Widow. Yeah, but the latest one was Shang Chi, and it really threw me off when he said it was the latest one. Oh yeah, one. Uh, think of one more. Think of one more. Think it's of the actually, one that rhymes with the thing actually, I said. It was actually last year's news, but I am a little surprised that the guy who lives in his parents' house and raps all day doesn't know about the latest movie stuff. You should be. You should have the time to be able to be up on this stuff. So. <laughs> that's why he said last year's news because there was a question about earwax, and I can't hear you. Ooh. Ooh. Right, so, we so we've got Peter Morris. The, the rhyme is Peter Morris. Yeah. Who was the, the battle? The battler? He's the Soros. Prehistoric. Who's that? Who is that? <laughs> is that I a rapper? Your, was that my last I went battle? on verse tracker for, on, on you, Bullets, when I was doing I research. Most recent, like prehistoric. I only remember the battles I won. That's- if you would have asked me about Shuffle T or Kid Twist or any of those. So add to the list of things that Shuffle needs to look up, modular and most recent. Those are two <laughs> I'm struggling with this episode. Might be my most recent battle. I'm not Good. Lie. I'm glad someone's keeping Adam accountable in this episode. Yeah, I just didn't think it would be my older self. I guess he's <laughs> looking back <laughs> fondly. I come back in time to shame you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so it was. Um, all right, what else did they miss? Was that, uh, all, was that all of them? No, Nameless got it again. It was Heard It and Jump for Joy. It was Certified Lover Boy. Yeah, I should have got that really. And then, um, yeah, that was it, man. Well, I, I want to give you question 10 just because I put a lot of effort into it and it was really <laughs> long. So I'm just going to give you that, but it's no points. You can't get a point. But it's for everyone, I guess. Uh, this person necks a cappuccino with great passion. Three film directors. This person next a cappuccino. Quentin Tarantino. With great passion. So you want this person and great passion. Tim Burton. Yeah. Quentin yeah. Tarantino and what was it? With passion. Uh, great, great passion. passion. Uh, great passion. All oh, right. Yeah, someone someone put it. it in the chat and they're right. Oh, no, James Cameron. Yeah. Oh, James Cameron. Damn. This oh, person oh. next to cappuccino with great passion. Tim Burton, Quentin Tarantino, and James Cameron. What Did James Cameron on? make Avatar? Yeah, and bloody Titanic. Titanic. Do, you, do you know Avatar had the most amount of suicides after it? So first, the first second film that had the most suicides after it was Exorcist, because everyone thought they were um, possessed. Avatar was because everyone thought they would never live in a world as beautiful as what James Cameron created. 
It's the most suicides oh, for any movie ever. God, what a poncy bunch. Okay, there's, there's a stat for we you. We have fact checkers on this show. I don't know. <laughs> well, no, don't worry. Because if it's. I, think, I, think, I, think, I just like, want to hold you there. I just want to hold you there. Because if it's, if it's, 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 the, it's, it's the most suicides after, then I'm willing to bet maybe it was the first ever film. Because that, as. I mean, what do you mean after? What's the time limit? Do you mean within 45 minutes and they go, I did this because of Avatar? Oh, I think there's a lot of people who, who said why they killed themselves and they wrote down Avatar. <laughs> Avatar was the reason. <laughs> it's in the suicide note. Avatar. They thought it was his favorite movie, ever. but it was really this suicide but, note. He yeah. had left it beside the body. Hey, this is I on, C- this is on CNN, that. and that's, oh, that's a reliable source. Audiences experience the Avatar blues. After watching it, there's thousands of posts Suicides too. Don't don't worry about it. Carry on anyway. Thousands of posts. I'm about to commit suicide. Yes. Well, 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 the on. biggest thing. Well, trust me. There's trust Game me. of Thrones found with a ticket stub in his pocket. As a, as a, well, I, I read it somewhere. Okay. Yeah. Next exactly. up is Kid Twist and Nameless. Uh, do you guys have a team name or? Well, I think it has to be Name Twist because if we go the opposite way with Kid List, it's extremely inaccurate. For <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, name twist. All right, three, two, one, go. Okay, Fort Knox, American snack or Canadian. Fort Knox. Corn pop. Corn pop. Corn uh, pop. Corn. Corn pop. Uh, uh, corn, corn dogs. Corn dogs. Okay. Pop bingo. Dogs. Bingo card. Member of the Beatles. Ringo, Ringo Starr. Star. Easy. Yeah. Okay. Tax attorney. Actor embodied. Oh, uh, the main uh one. Callum Worthy, but he says it Calum. So, but Callum Worthy. Does he say Calum? That's gross. Calum, All right, yeah. pink nails, <laughs> hairstyle that would suit Kid Twist. Pink or nameless, nails. Pink yeah. nails. Yeah, pink nails. I can see you there. All right, porcelain figure, so supermodel. Porcelain figure? Or, well, yeah. I guess it's more like what? porcelain. Yeah, uh, skip. All right. Uh, passing the time. Name of the music group Nameless was in. Martin McFly. Yep. That was yep. super hard. Courage. Um, round the corner. Doesn't work. Something doesn't work. So it's. Out of yeah. order. Yeah. Out of order. Okay. Yeah. Amazon River. Used when applying makeup. Come on. A hand glitter. No. Package of glitter. Um, Come on. Skip. Do you want to skip? Skip. Yeah, skip it. All right. Muddy Fox. Bicycle trick. Bunny hop. Yeah. Okay. Um, Dane Cook lost at Scribble Jam. Three big apps that recently went down. Dane Cook lost at Scribble Jam. Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram. This is bullshit. Uh... (laughs) All right, uh, Trophy oh, Fish yeah. novel. Sorry? Trophy Time, fish. I'm sorry. Ah. Was it a Vanity Mirror? It was Vanity Mirror. Oh, was Vanity okay. Mirror. Porcelain <laughs> figure. Supermodel. Yeah, I think that's a different in the, in the accent, you know? Is it Claudia it, Schiffer? The chat said Claudia Schiffer. Is that, yeah, see, yeah. Claudia. Yeah. Not yeah, pa- we say Claudia. Yeah, fair play. Uh, in fact, can you try saying win. Claudia it's Schiffer it's like, like that? I bet it sounds mad. Claudia. Claudia. Claudia that's pretty- <laughs> Were there any more? Was that it? No, they, they, Bagnall said it. It was uh, Amazon River. You use it to apply makeup. It was Vanity Mirror. So Very good. Vanity Mirror. And Very you did good. that. You did. You, you, you started a uh, trophy fish, but they ran out of time. But we can give it a, no points, whatever. Trophy fish novel. Moby Dick. Moby yeah. Dick. Nice little relevant rhyme for you. Yeah, that is good. relevant. Because in the book, they do call the whales a fish, even though mammal. Bagnall. Yeah. You claim to be a battle rap expert. Oh, uh, not really. I haven't watched battle um, since bullets stopped. But, uh, no, I've seen you when you're down the pub. It's all you talk about. Oh, no battle rap me. Yeah. People go, I don't know what a battle rap is. Oh, I'll tell you about, let me tell you about fucking disaster. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> if you're so clever, can you tell me the only two people out of me, Nameless and Kid Twist who haven't battled each other in one way or another? I know this. Out of you, Nameless and Kid Twist. That's right. Who uh, have no, Sorry, and, and Bullets. Oh, 
I would say that Nameless and Bullets haven't battled. I've you would be correct. Yeah. Yeah. As far as I know. Yep. Because um, I didn't you do a crane kick against Kid Twist in the, the jump off when you were making your own and organic was disqualified. Yep. On some Mr. Miyagi shit. I go, wow, I'm the fucking karate kid. <laughs> This is definitely the one that Jacob wants you to remember, not, you know, not no, the time where he completely destroyed me. <laughs> do, you remember, do you remember when Jump Off did that whole disqualification and Organic had to sit out on the side for a bit and then you decided yeah. to do crane kicks and go mental <laughs> that was, for a few minutes? That was amazing. That was actually against Bishop and Stretch Diesel. Oh, he Stretch did. Diesel. He was the character as I well. I think you it? rhymed, was it Miyagi Kick? Did you not write it? Is that what you wanted with? And, and, and karate kids yeah. and Miyagi kids. You want to laugh? And, and Mr. Miyagi bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember it. I will say, um, though me and Bullets haven't battled, we once did have a little Brazilian jujitsu rolling around in uh, in the back uh, in the of, of an event once, and he absolutely folded me into a pretzel. And <laughs> oh, he I gave thought, you a BJJ? Yeah, he gave you know, up. Long and hard BJJ. It was oh, pretty. That's crazy. That's. Oh, I got one of those from Bullets as well. Yeah. <laughs> He's very considerate. Should I help relax me for the upcoming battle? It was great. Anyway, keep it moving. Pavement squad. <laughs> Let's go. Well, I tapped. We went up the. We went up the steps, and you know, he tapped me out on the pavement. It was, uh, okay. was it, was it jujitsu or wrestle when he folded you into a pretzel? Oh, oh there we go. There we I'm go. central today. It's rhythmically central. Oh. Uh, which one do you think has the most views? The two on two that we had against uh, Nameless and Twist. Right. Uh, me versus Bullets, Kid Twist versus Bullets, or Nameless versus Kid Twist? I me believe this is going to be a question that's designed to stroke your ego. Um, <laughs> so I believe it will be the two on two because Marlo was in it to bring the views up on your side. And then obviously because Kid Twist's name is there, that would add. Shows what you know, his name wasn't even in the introduction. In fact, it, it, his name isn't even in the title, which right. means that it doesn't show up in his verse track of stats, which is why I've got more views than him. So, right. you know, who's the loser now? Default, yeah. absolute right. default. Yeah, there we go. So was that, was that correct as well? Yeah, 307,749. Oh, wow, uh, you that off the top. Bullets is 188,988. <laughs> kid Sorry. Twist first bullets, 150,608. Nameless first kid twist, 218,332. Clocking in at the second most viewed one. Right. Well, um, kid so... Twist are the, the, clearly the factor that gets the views, right? To be honest, Kid Obviously, Twist. Yeah. Like, I, I Actually, kind of... the, the factor is nobody Good likes point. to see me beat their favorite white rappers. So. True. <laughs> they no just, those, you, those videos get buried. <laughs> Battle They're unlisted. They're unlisted. <laughs> <laughs> All right, round 2.5. It's an extra round. There are no points. This week it is called <laughs> 100 Bullets. This is where I am going to show you some bullets, and it will be up to you guys to identify <laughs> the type. What are these bullets? Bullets, what do you reckon? They look like nine millimeters to me. Just nine millimeters. <laughs> Just to hazard How, a What do you think a millimeter is? No, oh. those are those are big ass bullets. Any ideas? Twenty <laughs> twos? Those are those are those are forty fives right there. Oh, they're forty fives. Those are these uh, are those are gun bullets. Yeah. <laughs> Correct as always. That is a full metal jacket. That is called a full metal jacket. What the okay. that is? That bullet is called a full metal jacket, and these are, are known metal. collectively as full metal jackets. What's this words. one? Isn't that Goma Pile? Um... <laughs> Goma Come Pile on. with a loaded rifle. Ballistics. Come on. They're hollow points. Ballistics. Hollow points. Those are. They're lead round noses. What? See? Well, not around here in Canada, they're all the points. Yeah, I, I think these are the English names for the points. <laughs> we um, don't have names for them. We have no need. <laughs> we don't have guns. We don't have them. We call them BB. What are these? Ah, uh, isn't that, that, isn't that, that uh, Jeff Bezos's spaceship? <laughs> <laughs> Those are. Oh, you guys uh, don't know your bullets. That's tip. a jacket in hollow point. 
Oh, right, of course. That's the hollow point. See, that's I got him confused. I One of Bagno's nipple I tassels. From the Bullet points. I know Bullet these points. Bullets. Correct. <laughs> yeah, as in 100 bullets has not gotten any of these this game show yet. Because <laughs> I fight. Uh, I'm a man. I don't need <laughs> Sardines. What would you call this? A, ca- a, ca- a tin of bullets? Smelly bullets. It's a bullet tin. It's a bullet tin. Oh. It's a bullet tin. It's a bullet tin. It's bullet a visual tin. pun. It's a visual pun. And um, what about that? Right. What do you think of this? That, <laughs> that is 10 pellets. That's the bullet from Mario, <laughs> from Mario Brothers. <laughs> bullet bill. Does anyone know the answer? Um, bullets. 100 bullets. I see why you'd say that, but no, it's actually... Oh, there's um, a bullet there. That's a shotgun bullet, isn't it? No, it's a wad cutter. It's Or something uh, like that. That's CeeLo Green. That. <laughs> I thought you were zooming <laughs> in on the Zildo there. <laughs> what is the one I hear? Right, it's a singular... Oh, that got such a bigger laugh in my head. <laughs> I'm honestly like more embarrassed for Shuffle than I am for Bagnall. If both of them, if one of them was like scooping cat shit out while the other one was making this PowerPoint presentation, I'm more embarrassed for, for Shuffle. Look, look, nameless, I'm going to level with you. I'm trying to make this show as entertaining as I can. Um, and I'm, if that I'm means any length, sticking around in my cat's asshole, I'm so I, I, I will go to any length to, to make this hey, show man, good. <laughs> Bagnell doesn't even have a cat. He just borrowed his name. <laughs> <laughs> like, Weird question, right? But can I borrow your cat's shit? I've got a banging rhyme for my game show that I play online with my friends. Yeah. I'm gonna take a look through. Um, do, do the thing. The the rhymes in the uh, the rhymes from people at home. Bagnell's cat shit tray. Squid game. That's that's pretty good. Squid game link chain. That's good. Squid game kiss chase. Big brain. Gimp face, Nick Cave, Twin Snakes. This is my dream, just sitting around just saying rhyming words. What does it sound like? Sounds like a multi to me. What does it sound like? We move now on to round three. This round is called Count Up. You get a barring limit of half a minute. I'm going to give everybody 30 seconds to come up with a setup and punchline, which has to rhyme in a classic line on a scheme that will tell you twats in time. At the end of that 30 seconds, you're going to perform them for Blees to rank them from first to worst. Okay, Blees, what scheme are they writing from today? Semolina. Semolina. We've tasted that delicious food and now you get to what's semolina i don't really know what it is okay everyone understands the rules i was <laughs> i don't remember either <laughs> right everyone understand the rules you got 30 seconds starting from now bag no not 10 seconds ago go go step up in a punchline okay. I don't that rhymes with semolina you can use semolina and ingredients and rhyming baby now, um, don't be distracted as well. Just keep your eyes on the prize. You've got 15 seconds left. Well, 12 now. Well, 11. 10. Or <laughs> well, 8 now. 7. 6. F- 5 seconds left. Well, 4. 3, sorry. 2. 1 second. Uh, time. That's One. it. <laughs> That's bullets. I think you were doing yours in your head. I didn't see any um, writing motion. So I'm going to ask you to go first. What did you, what did you get done? Um, a semolina, right? That's right. You checking now? Uh, all right. It's just anything that rhymes with that setup and punch. Yeah. Yeah. Don't act all like right. you. Do. <laughs> nah, I Come mean, you no, know, for real. I was just trying to figure out what rhyme with semolina, but anyway. Um. Oh, I said that. Yeah, I, I really. Uh... <laughs> What's <laughs> happening? Are you are you buffering? You joking? <laughs> You're joking. Semolina. <laughs> you joking right now? Hold on, hold on. I don't really care. To when I honest. think back in battle raps about something with semolina, if you look for a battle where someone chokes, it's never me either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. 
answer. Okay. No. <laughs> but it's never me. Either. Bruh. Uh, it's never me, bruh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never me, bruh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's fire. It was a fake Yo, choke. A, that oh, was a fake oh, choke. He, y'all did it again. <laughs> okay, well, that was fucking excellent. <laughs> uh, we all agree there's no real need for anyone else to go, but just for the sake of it, should we go yeah. with, uh, I don't know, Twist next? Sure. All right. <clears throat> First off, <laughs> I don't know the word semolina, but I'll still get my Nina and turn the wall behind you to a Donda part two song. It's got extra features. Man, that is tight. Them internals, man. Beautiful. That's tight between you and bullets there. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know I, had exactly. <laughs> I had the performance. I, I said, yeah, the, yeah, no, the moment. Sure. Yeah, the moment. This, this was, that was great. He's from back in the day. I'm from the moments era. <laughs> <laughs> all right, nameless, go. All right, all right. Semolina, Semolina, petty heathens, get them eaten like the unleavened bread of Jesus. <laughs> all right. Um, like it. All it right. Petty heathens and the bread of Jesus. Come on. Yes. Come on. Oh, I can see what you're doing. I can see where you're going. Like all it. Right. Cool. You're Close. playing with the four. It might be second. That. It might Much be second. like Donda. All right. Very good. All right. Bagnall, what did you um, write down? All right. Good. So I've got, um, I'll bring that 90s violence. Like, do you remember Xena? Car <laughs> 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 Car, Car, I will hit you. Don't make me get ah. the Xena. Car, I will hit you. Wheel hit you. This is a bullet bar. Don't make me get the Beamer. I thought that was great. <laughs> I thought it was great. Wait, why are you saying car at the bar. beginning? Why, you, why do you just say the word car? Because I'm I'm using it like cos. Oh, like cos. Cos. Uh, no, that's, that's, that's uh, not. Oh, bullets, you'd use that all day, mate. You'd use that all day. <laughs> what were we saying earlier about That cool. was a bullets inspired one. Uh, I would okay. say the wheel part, but. What were we saying about wheel. forces earlier, man? What about these forces? That wasn't, that wasn't a force at all. That's a forced wheeler. Oh. That wasn't. I thought that was good. That was good. I, I stand by that. You stand by that. I stand by it. With your cat shit in hand, you stand by that. <laughs> I stand by that. Stop <laughs> bringing it back on. Do that anymore. Remember I Zena, can Come see on. The fucking kitty yeah. treats in there still. Fuck Mighty me. Violence. I thought that was great. Don't you worry. Carry on. No, I was all about the Zena bar. To be fair, I did quite like that. Remember Zena? Zena? Yeah. I was like, I do. I do yeah. remember. Yeah, that's yeah. A- I thought head. you were going to say Semolina and then pull out the bag and go, remember these ones? <laughs> <laughs> well, that, but that wouldn't have rhymed. That wouldn't have rhymed. Oh, you could have said, I got this shit in the bag. <laughs> oh, oh, these, oh, shit. Well, well, oh. Why, didn't, why didn't you do yeah. that? Instead, you just I, don't have, I don't have a cat. <laughs> All right, please. Uh, <clears throat> from, from, from bullets to best, <laughs> what, what's the score? <laughs> so for Semolina, they see you knocked it out of the park like Derek Jeter. Oh, I'm gonna go. Um, to be fair, I am sorry, bullets. So I'm gonna put you fourth, man. Of course, don't be. A, don't yeah, you so don't say sorry, you though, baby. Say sorry. I'm gonna sorry. go. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Bullets four. I'm gonna put Bagnall third. Oh, that's surprising. That is surprising. And then I'm gonna put, I'm gonna go nameless second and kid twist. Fucking killed that shit, man. Wow. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Lovely little internals. You know what I mean? Technical, uh, man. Technical. Is it? Is, Shuffle, is it even possible for me and Bullets to come back on this one? Because I feel like there is a sturdy lead happening. There's I, been I a lot of stuff. Is, I mean, it's possible. It's not probable. Right, good. Carry on. Now, round four is always on a specific theme. And before you answer, you have to raise your hand and say, sounds like, and I will choose who gets to answer first. If you answer out of turn, you will be Dr. Point. Now, last week we did, I think it was talk show host, wasn't it? Or, or did we do something since then? Yeah, we did uh, We did Bond films, man. We Bond, Bond films, yeah. Bond yeah. films. So what have we got this? Recent again. What a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Trending. Bond. Trending. What did we do this? What have we got this week? What have we got now? Uh, this week we are doing Simpson characters. Oh, <laughs> very good. How are you guys feeling about that? Let's. I only know four characters from The Simpsons. I don't watch The Simpsons. Right, good. <laughs> so let's have a test trial. We are looking for a Simpsons character that rhymes with, for example, oh dear, we are in trouble. Are in trouble. 
Who would that be? Sounds like Barney Rubble. Nameless. Rome. Yes, Ooh. but you must wait Ooh. to be okay. asked. I love that right? you dabbed as you said it. I want, you, I want <laughs> everyone to dab on every answer. Okay, instead All of right. raising your hand, can you dab and say sounds like? Is yeah, that I a... think that's sounds fine. Like... <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, in... I'm making that a rule from all all episodes. I'm glad that one's out of the way because I don't know Barney, Barney Gumble. Yeah, jeez. Yeah, sorry. Barney Rubble. Isn't he from? Did you say Rubble? That's yeah, yeah, he's that Barney Rubble, character. character. That's Flintstones, man. Number one, Solar System. Sounds like. Sounds like. Bagnall, I think that was. Bagnall. Homer Simpson. Homer Simpson. Gus Bagnall, there, yeah. Uh, Absolutely okay. correct, sir. Okay, what about this one then? I Robot. I robot. Come on. Yeah. Bullets. What's the word? What do I gotta say? <laughs> Sounds like. <laughs> Sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> Bullets uh, is doing a short bar. miming intuition. Yeah, Sideshow side bar. Yeah. Very good. Oh, very dope. Bar. Bob, and that's one of Bob. four he knows. So there's only yeah. three left he could get. Now he's in trouble. He's in trouble now. He's but. the one who's got the the thigh bone lodged. Mm. Side show Bob's got a thigh bone lodged. Mm. Huh? I know, boss. <laughs> Can you turn <laughs> your fucking iPhone off? <laughs> right. Low in fat. Low in fat. Sounds like. <laughs> you look like you're going to sneeze back now. Go on. Uh, it's, yeah. Uh, Moe Sislak. You're correct. You're correct. Oh, we should have done Pokemon for bullets. Mm. Someone said he would be better at Pokemon. That would have been perfect. Please, you fucking idiot. Favorite. You should have done that. All right. Belgian buns. Oh, sounds like Nelson Pit Munz. Yeah. Nelson, yes. Munz. Nelson Munz. Nelson Munz, nice. Also yeah. good with uh, Elmer Fudd. Another cartoon character. You Who is bullish? Yeah. Okay. Grief stricken. Sounds like a oh, bagnell. Chief Wiggum. Correct. Very good. You're, you're catching up, to be fair. All right. Best option. Best option. Oh, it's Stuncher. All right. Give them the initials, please. First name, K. Oh, best option. First name what? Hello, I am best so, option. Oh, first initial was K. Oh, uh, oh, fight, uh, sounds uh, like good twist. Uh, it's Kent Brockman. Oh, yes, fuck's sake, that was very good, very good. But it doesn't oh. know that one. Do we really have to keep doing the dab? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, fucking points you do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, anchovy, anchovy. Oh, sounds like uh, Bagnall, fat Tony. Correct. Nice. Very good. Very nice. Uh, biblical figure. Sounds like? Bagnell. Principal Skinner. Oh my God, Bags, you're smashing this round. Well done, mate. Well done. Oh, All right. Yeah. Uh, live and learn. Mr. Burns. Sounds like. Sounds like. Oh, sounds like. 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 Yeah, well, you, you've broken even on that. Because oh. <laughs> he lost you one and you got one. Right, cheers. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I went, went like this. So Mr. Like... Burns. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's my greeting when I see you. Okay. Him. And this one, don't be put off, right? The rhyme is Patty's sister Selma. That's the rhyme. No one put it in the chat, please. Uh, sounds like. Uh, nameless. Santa's little helper. Oh, yes. That's a great Very one. Nice. By the way. Good. Very nice. Oh, la, la. I had that. I had that's the mine. The way that, the way that Jamie Blease acts, acts like genuinely surprised and impressed by these rhymes that he has written all of himself. <laughs> I know. Like, oh, that one was crazy. That was loud. That <laughs> one was me. <laughs> because, that's my one, isn't it? Um, <laughs> If, if you didn't realize, we're, we're, Delma, we're, Santa's little helper abandoned in a shelter. Ooh. That is, that is. What does it sound like?
Sounds like a multi to me. To round five of Sounds Like, it's hardly hard, it's bar for bar. I say that every week, I need to change that one. This is where we pit two players against each other to have a direct rhyme off on a scheme to rhyme bubbly and I. You'll be paired up with a minute and a half of uninterrupted back to back lines. If you can't continue, then you are disqualified. It's never happened, I don't enforce that rule. If you make it through the one and a half minutes, then it'll be up to Bleeze to hear what you said and see who's clearly the best. Who is going to go first, little Bleezy? Twist and bags. Shit. Twist right. versus bagnal. Twit. Cat just shit my cacks. <laughs> <laughs> With your cat. Yeah, because it's in the yeah. bag. In the bag. Shit my cacks. Right, in um, the bag. <laughs> right. <coughs> you've, got a, you've got a minute and a half. I'm on the run. I would like story. bagnal to start. Um, and oh, the good. The rhyme scheme that you're going to work on, going back to back. First one, you know, just just sort of conversationally. Yeah. Doesn't have to be dissing. It can be friendly. Um, is Tony and Guy. Tony and Guy. Three, two, one. Tony and Guy. Um, last time I was in Canada, I thought, I think I got you a drink. Don't you owe me a wine? Well, you could have said pine. Wine. No, it was a wine. <laughs> we're, we're cultured here. <laughs> uh, I don't think I owe you a wine. Uh, you might be pretty tall, but skills, you're Napoleon size. Oh, oh it's okay. true. That's made me feel broken inside. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's okay. You're going to be redeemed. I see the holiest light. Oh, that actual light. Is <laughs> <laughs> I won't be able to see it because I'm holding my eyes. <laughs> Why? It's okay. Just engage in some daily wank habits on your loneliest nights. Um... <laughs> Um, Ooh, that sounds like the loneliest site. Uh, <laughs> oh, I don't want to think of this site. When I'm uh, groping my thighs. <laughs> it's a double. <laughs> uh, these glasses and mustache look like a homely disguise. Um, <laughs> Very good. Uh, <coughs> I, that, that mustache and glasses make it look like you could be smoking a pipe. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. Uh, that's I good. I was. It would make me look more old and refined. Um, oh! Refined. Uh, old and refined, like you're listening to Moby tonight. Do you remember Moby? It's old. <laughs> Moby tonight to be old and refined? I don't know, but I think that Mozart's all right. <laughs> oh! uh, 20 seconds. We were talking about Simpsons a minute ago. I ever told you that Mo is my guy? Wait, <laughs> 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 my guy? Uh, Mo is your guy? The only person off the Simpsons uh, I know is the fly. Oh, he's a bumblebee. Oh, bumblebee. But, and, yeah, you know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, All right. Oh, it is time. That's my toe in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, the desperation on his face. Uh, I, I was running out of options. I was running out of options. Oh, oh God. That's, that's a key Never point. just, oh. oh. I'm sweating. Never trust your gut, <laughs> That's the wrong. That, 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 oh. That, that was close. That was actually, I it genuinely, was that was closer that than was I was thought it would be. That is what I'm going to say. Yeah, good replies back and forth. Lovely replies back and forth. Uh, Bagnall did say lonely after. Lonely was already said as well, which oh. is a shame. Mm -hmm. It happens, oh, it happens. Yeah, it happens. A little happens. bit of a shame. Because that was the that was the best line for me, the uh, the loneliest nights. Because uh, Kid Twist, you mentioned um Shuffle, what is it in Shuffle's thing? The, 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 on the notepad habits. I write daily wank habits. The daily wank habits from your loneliest nights. See, that's genius because he's referenced it again from earlier. Oh, so. yeah, and I said it. loneliest nights when I'm groping my thighs, you know, it was a it was a call and response. Oh, I thought he said when I've <laughs> broken my thighs. I was like, broken. why are you wanking with casts on? No, no, no. Wet. Just beating so hard, broke my thighs. No, it was groping, <laughs> groping, groping. Right, groping your own thigh. Yeah, I love the idea of you come. You, you're doing foreplay before you wank. <laughs> it, there was a whole mental image to it, but fine. You have to get yourself in the mood, you know. <laughs> yeah, specifically by stroking my own thighs. thighs before you wank. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna give it to Kid Twist, man. I'm give it to Kid, Kid Twist, Twist, isn't it? Yeah, it's Twist. Good. Good. Good man, I enjoyed that. I enjoyed it. I'm, I'm, I'm happy to have lost. Yeah. I'm happy to have lost. I'm fine. I thought I didn't care. No, I'm fine. Losing. I think it's fun. I, I think it builds character. No, I do. Yeah, it doesn't right. matter. It's fine. Okay. And now we have um, 
Well, for the first time, we have bullets versus nameless. Wow. Uh, which is, it's, uh, meaning that by the end of this, we, we will all have battled each other in some way. <laughs> That's the language I'm using, in some way. Nameless is going to start. Um, you have two minutes or so, and uh, you have the inverse of Tony and Guy. You have Brighton and Hove. Die did a do from do did a die. What? What's your beef bullets? Yeah, it's where it's where Blees is from. That's where it's I live, like, right? Don't know any geography outside of your own country. Okay, <laughs> let's go with uh, Brighton and Hove. I want Nameless to start. Three, two, one. Brighton and Hove. Brighton and Hove. Uh, you look pretty nice in your home. Mm. <laughs> it's true. You do. Brighton and Hove. It's a place uh, that this guy didn't know. Mm. <laughs> Good. You sound, you sound very bored. Isn't this exciting you, bro? Uh, because I'm not really liking the show. Ooh. Ooh, fuck. Doesn't like hearing that. Oh, well. <laughs> that um, I think you can uh, blame it on the guys on the coast. Uh, they're on the side on mine. I don't know if that makes <laughs> sense. You, you um, could have had a host. It was right there. Yeah, I mean, one fight between us, I punch <laughs> your eye. It explodes. <laughs> <laughs> Dangerous man. Yeah. Wait, I liked it more when we were fighting the hosts. I'm a titan with gloves, like I'm fucking spiking a moat. That's like throwing <laughs> you in a, in a in a place beside the castle in a in a little. Uh, gotcha. Uh, yeah. yeah. Not and boat. your imagery is unmatched. I can't. Yeah, that's maybe right. Vikings little boat. Vikings. Ooh, nice. Good. I'm, I'm a Viking with quotes. Viking again? Yeah, you, all right. Wait, did he say Viking? Yeah. Viking boats, yeah. Uh, let's remember that one in the judging. <laughs> <laughs> so am I going to go? Or... Oh! 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 How much time till we're through? <laughs> Bro? Bro? Bro. <laughs> 25 seconds, yo. <laughs> okay, 35 till it's done. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Right, guys, I gotta go. I see what you mean about the stretching. <laughs> Ten seconds, gone. But you can't move in front of your background uh, too much, or or the lighting gets broke. <laughs> uh... <laughs> All right, let's give him a hand, guys. I mean, we already know I won. That's something that. <laughs> All right, it's time. It's time. It's right, time. gonna play like, less night. We, we, we That's right? time. <laughs> All right, please. Which way will Caesar's thumb point? It's tight because they were both coming back so quick together. The only I know that Nameless didn't hear him say Viking, which is a shame because I think I spoke Viking. over it. Yeah, yeah. Um, but but the one that the guy that made me laugh was Bullets. I'm giving it to Bullets. Hey, I'm not mad at that. I I, I, I get a better Nameless is a. Is it I gotta go? Is it I gotta go? Oh man, yeah. killed it. That was very good. Great opponent, nameless. You 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 brought the best out of me without him. You know, I mean, I just want to thank God. The first power rap wins this one. So power humble. rap wins this one. <laughs> right. Fans, crowd won. three zero. Crowd three zero. <laughs> that was amazing. Very 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 interesting scores, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies, there's we don't have any, and no ladies on there. Um, right. I can tell you right now that Pavement Squad Pavement have 20, squad. 23 points. It's my lucky number. Uh, well, today it's not because Name Twist oh. have 30 points. Ooh. Really fucking smashed you. I'm not into it. Twist. So Name congratulations. Twist. More like score twist, am I right? <laughs> yeah, you are right. You are right. What you forced it? You forced it. Did we? Congratulations to these two. You win two middle fingers up from everyone else. So congratulations. Keep that. Um, just before we finish, we'll have a final look through the audience's suggestions for Squid Games, Rib Cage, uh, Clip Play. Jesus. <laughs> Actually, the, I'd like to point out the Clip Play is also somewhat relevant because I've seen a lot of memes with the honeycomb they have to lick and people make it a vagina. You know, so the Clip Play. <laughs> I know. see. I can see the relevance. Okay, okay. My, my vote is for Bagnall, Bagnall's cat shit tray. 
I'm same. I'm 100% the same. Yeah. I'm a bit the same. All right. So that is um, <laughs> so old friend, Big Gobbler. <laughs> Big oh, Gobbler's uh, made a reappearance again. Fair play to him. Yeah. Big Gobbler's, Big Gobbler's done it again. Oh, so there you man. go, Gobbler. Well done, Gobby. You get in next week for free. So if you think you can do any better, then leave your rhyme on the comments or on our Twitter, and we'll have a look through some of them on our next live show. Congratulations, and thanks, everybody at home, for watching. Thanks to our guests, Bagnall, Bullets, Twist, and Nameless. Thank you, everyone, for watching, and good night. Oh,